I am a recycling artist. I sculpt detergent bottles into um, animals. I was going to a church in Washington, D.C. that had an outdoor sculpture garden, and I thought I would create one piece for that garden. What ended up being one piece turned into 14, and I actually filled the whole garden myself. A lot of people actually use drugs to be creative. I actually got off drugs, and that's when I was creative. I started uh, creating art when I was um, in early recovery uh, about three years ago. The objects that I use to create my art are recycled products and they also represent myself um, being recycled also. I would see something I want to make something out of it, but um, I was always just fiddling and never getting anything done. But once I got clean, all of a sudden I had this new vision and I was able to focus on things. And as I was holding a detergent bottle one day, I looked at it and it looked just like a dog's head. So I decided to make a dog out of detergent bottles and then that led to an entire fleet of detergent bottle animals. Recycling takes a product and as you repurpose it, it weakens it or diminishes its capacity for what it was. And it's not as strong, it's not as solid. But when you upcycle something, you give it a completely new purpose and a completely new use and you actually make it better than it was before. There's always something you can continue to do, another way you can fix something, some way you can make something better, and that's also representative of what I try to do in my life, is to make every day better than it was before.